So, training camps have begun to rev up across the NFL. Let's focus in on the Browns. Rookies and quarterbacks reported Friday and vets report on Tuesday, which means Deshaun Watson has already reported to training camp for business as usual. That is, at least for now, as the Browns and the rest of us really await word from the NFL disciplinary officer Sue L. Robinson on a potential suspension. The Browns currently have three other quarterbacks on the roster, likely fill-in starter Jacoby Brissett, Josh Rosen, who they added last week, and then they also have Josh Dobbs. Okay, so Browns reporter Jake Trotter here joins us now on SportsCenter. And Jake, what more can you tell us about what Deshaun Watson has been doing since he did report to camp on Friday? Well, Shay, keep in mind that Deshaun Watson is still relatively new to this Browns offense. In fact, all four quarterbacks are new as well. So they have been delving into Coach Kevin Stefanski's playbook, trying to get a jump start on his schemes, uh, getting ready for the start of training camp. They've also been doing some light passing drills outside without pads, just doing everything they can to be prepared for when the rest of the team arrives this week. Speaking of the rest of the team, what is the overall mood there at training camp and like in the building as we await for a potential disciplinary ruling on Watson? Yeah, Shay. So I spoke to someone in the building just this weekend, and the mood is this. They are waiting, just like the rest of us, for mm -hmm. a decision. Now, they've had the expectation that they would hear from Judge Robinson before the start of training camp, but that's just an expectation. They don't know for sure yet when that decision is going to come. And they don't know, Shay, what that decision is going to entail. All right. Well, we'll all wait like we have been, right, for this answer as well. Of course, the Browns open up the preseason on August 12th against the Jaguars. Jake Trotter, thanks so much. The latest here on SportsCenter. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.